Welcome Cancers, I'm back y'all with another video. So let's talk, let's see what messages we got for you for the month of October. All right, so if you have Cancer and your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node, South Node, you can utilize this video, okay? Thank you, ancestors, spirit guides, angels. I ask for protection during this read. For my cancers. Give me a message for cancers, please. Let me get a message for cancer. All right, so we got a jumper. We got the nine of cups here. All right, so let's see what we get. We got the nine of cups. We got the judgment at the bottom and the seven of wands. I feel like some of y'all are standing your ground. You've made a final decision that you're going to stand up for yourself, stand your ground. Okay, you're not about to let nobody walk all over you like that. Okay, we got the seven of swords, the moon, the knight of pentacles, the fool, the ten of wands, the star, knight of swords, queen of wands, and the page of cups. All right, so let's get into it. Maybe you want to slow things down. You're making a, a decision and you feel like things are, you know, this is your time to stand up and speak what you want in this connection, in this situation. Maybe some of you want to slow things down just because you just feel like it. You just feel like, okay, well, let's slow things down a little bit. Let's take our time. And ain't no need to rush. This person wants to rush in. Okay, this person wants to rush in. Like, they want to, like, just rush in. And you're like, mm, I feel like we just need to take our time. Mainly because we got the seven of swords that's crossing this energy. So somebody could be, you know, untrustworthy. Let's just say that. They could be a liar, a cheater, sneaky, manipulative person. So why is the nine of cups here? The tower. Some of y'all are breaking down the foundation. You want a foundation to break down. Like you like, yeah, let's break this this down so there could be a new beginning, a new start. Okay, something new, some new energy because the energy that was there could have possibly just been too too much. People's just been doing too much. Okay, so there's some changes. You want to see some changes. So a foundation is breaking down. You want this foundation. I'm gonna say this. You want this foundation to break down. Why is the tower here? The page of swords. Maybe you want to spy on this person. You want to see what this person got going on. What they doing? What they got going on? Let me see what's going on with this person before I make my move. Tell me about this moon energy. That's confirmation, boo boo. Why is the moon here? Maybe you want to see what this person is hiding. Yeah, we got four of cups. You want to see how this person is feeling. Before you make your move, you want to see how this person is feeling. Okay. <laughs> Before you make your move, so you're being strategic. You're being very strategic. You're taking your time. <laughs> You been waiting for some sneaky shit to happen. Like, you just waiting on it. It's like, you just could just be feeling like, <sighs> you might know this person so well that it's just like, it's about that time for them to do some something. They got something going on. They got something going on. I want to see. Before I make this move, before I, you know, let my guard down, I want to see because I don't know. <laughs> One, three, one, two. The Eight of Swords. Mm -hmm. You've been waiting to catch this person. You're trying to catch this person up. 
You trying to catch this person up. So when you communicate with them, when you talk to them, there needs to be some type of apology too. You've been waiting on an apology from this person. Three of swords and the eight of wands, seven of pentacles. You've been waiting on an apology from this person. Why is the knight of pentacles here? The high priestess and the eight of pentacles. Your intuition is telling you to kind of like slow things down. You've been trying to. You've been trying to. You've been trying to take your time with this person or the situation. Because I feel like you are trying to change the energy of this situation. But this is something that you can't figure out. You want to know the truth about this person. Could be a fire sign, knight of wands here. You want to know what this person is hiding. Like, what this person, what do they have going on? It's just something about you that I'm just trying to catch. It's like, I just feel like some of y'all is just trying to catch this person up in their lives. That you're just trying to make sure that if, when you deal with this person, you know all the details. You took a risk in the past with this fool here. You took a leap of faith. You took a risk on this person. You may have um, borrowed, let this person borrow from you. You could have, um, yeah, I feel like you've been giving, you've been giving to this person. You've been extremely giving to this person. You feel like, damn, I could have just kept my money. You know what I'm saying? That was a risk. I could have just kept my money. I could have kept that gift. I could have kept that energy. Maybe you did something to help this person out and this person walked away from you. Somebody could have got ghosted in the past. I'm seeing you giving this person a lot of energy. Now, moving forward, we got the Ten of Wands here. The Emperor wanted to show himself to be done with the Aries. Why is the Ten of Wands here? Justice. I feel like you want karma. You want justice to be served in this situation. I feel like you put it in a lot because you feel burdened by the situation. So you put in a lot. I feel like you want to find some justice in the situation. You feel like you didn't get, you're not getting what you want out of the deal with the Ten of Swords and the Nine of Pentacles. Okay, you're not getting what you want out of the deal. So you want some justice. You want justice to be served. Hierophant. There could be a marriage involved. Someone could be married. Someone may find out the truth. Okay? Find out, get some clarity about someone who is possibly like legally separated or somebody is in full-fledged in a marriage. Tell me about this Ace of Swords. Could be dealing with a Taurus. There's that Emperor. Yeah, somebody could be saying, hey, I... I actually have a husband or I actually have a wife or um, I'm, I, I'm, I do have a boyfriend. I am seeing someone. Why is the emperor here? And the page of wands. The page of wands and the king of wands could be dealing with the Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. I see a lot of of with that nine of swords energy. That's kind of like uh overthinking. A lot of overthinking energy. Um this person didn't tell you. I don't feel like you saw this information coming. Um and I feel like you regret being so giving to this person. I feel like you regret being so open to this person. Um I do see a lot of sex going on. But that empress and that, that ace of wands of pregnancy could possibly be involved as well, too. Now, we got the star here. Could be dealing with an Aquarius. And the three of swords. I feel like you're, heal, you're healing. 
you're healing from some type of situation or you're going through some type of healing. Um, but I still see you. Yeah, you've been on a break. You've been taking time off because I feel like you guys are healing from something. There's something that you're healing from. Um, but I still feel like you're keeping an eye on the situation. Being that you and this person could have possibly been in a break, period. You want to know what's going on. Yeah, it's like, what's new? Ace of Cups and Two of Swords. What's new? What's new? This person is the Knight of Swords energy. Okay, why is the Knight of Swords energy? This person is really like stuck at a crossroad. Um, they got the Ace of Cups energy. They're stuck at they're not they're stuck at a crossroad about how they feel. Okay, so it's like they either don't want to show you how they feel, they don't want you to know how they truly feel. Why is the ace of cups here? They're at a crossroad. King of Pentacles, Virgo Taurus, Capricorn. Um some of them may have just started a new job, a new, you know, business or something like that. They are focused on their their focus on their independence and what makes them happy. They 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 have feelings. The feelings are there with the King of Cups and the Six of Cups. The feelings are there and they think about you all the time. You're on this person's mind. But they're, they want to take their time, too. They're kind of waiting. Even though I feel like this person wants wholeheartedly wants to rush, smash into you. They're taking their time. Because they may be in, in a situation that's... Their life may not be put all, to, all together. Okay? King of Wands, Queen of Cups. Uh, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. Queen of Cups. You guys' energy. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. There could be arguments and fights in the home or in about money. Okay. I feel like you are hoping that this person makes you an offer. Like... There's some type of offer. The Queen of Wands is there. She's very sexy. She's very confident. She's very bold. Um, so it's definitely oh, here. You guys, this energy is again with this Queen of Cups and this King of Wands. Um, I feel like this also. I feel like this situation also is a power trip. Okay, now we got the Five of Wands and the Strength card. There's a struggle of power. A struggle of who. You know what I'm saying? It's like a, a, a power struggle between you and this person. But I feel like you're you you're hoping that this person makes you an offer of love with the King of Cups. You're hoping this person makes you an offer of love, so you can feel victorious, feel like you won, like you're getting what you just finally deserve. This person is going to reach out to you. Page of Cups and the Three of Pentacles. This person is going to want to collaborate with you, work with you, work together. Um, I still feel like there are going to be issues with the power struggle thing here, but this person is going to communicate with you. They are going to reach out. Yep. Two of cups. It looks like this connection is going to be worked on. This could be a business connection. This could be a, um, relationship, but whatever this is, there is going to be a conversation that is going to be had about working together and being on the same page. Okay. So for sure, for sure, it definitely looks like communication is going to be open there's going to be some flirting going on and i feel like you guys are going to be able to come together and work on this partnership yep six of cups there's a reunion i'm seeing someone saying stop going back and forth need to try to find some balance okay but for sure for sure it definitely does look like this connection is going to be coming together all right, so I see you doing a little bit of investigating um, to make sure, you know, trying to see what you're getting your you're getting into before you get back into this. But I feel like y'all are on a break period. But 
I feel like you're you're you need the tea first. Like you need to do some investigating first. Find out what this person head is, what this person got going on. But I see this connection coming back together. Like it meshes back together. All right. So that's the message that I have from my cancers. All right. So if this message resonated, be sure to hit the thumbs up. As well, comment below in the comment section. Share with your family and your friends. If you're new, click the bell to subscribe. Until next time.